Hey guys, I wanted to make this video to check out Omni Snitch. Now, yes, you heard me correctly, I said Omni Snitch. Basically, this is a backport of the Omni Switch feature that was developed by the Omni ROM team. The advantage of Omni Snitch is it doesn't have to be baked into the custom ROM, so you can just install this on any ROM via the APK, which of course is included in the description below. Be aware it's still a work in progress, so there is a few bugs, but it is a quite convenient feature, so yeah, let's go ahead and check it out. So if you haven't heard of Omni ROM's Omni Switch feature before, it's essentially an open source app switcher that floats on top of your applications. So you can see it on the side of my screen right now, if I want to activate it I can just swipe it out it's got a nice animation and here you can see my recent apps you also have some features on top of that for example a clear and clear all button I should mention that on Omni Snitch right now these two do not work they just cause it to force close I'm not sure why that is like I said it is a work in progress so I'm sure they will figure those out you then have switch to your last application go home and settings so like I said, this is drawn on top of your application. So let's dive into Twitter. I then decide I want to change application. You can just swipe this out, change to Google Chrome, swipe it out again, change to settings. You can see it. Once you get used to it, this is very quick and it just becomes second nature. If you're someone like me, especially that likes to use the expanded desktop mode, you don't like to have your nav bar there, it just makes switching between your applications that much easier. So yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at the settings. One thing I forgot to mention there guys before we head over to the settings, if you're wondering what happens if you have more than five applications in your recents, well, yep, you can just go ahead and scroll through them. So it does show all your recents you currently have active. Okay, so here we go with the settings. At the top, you have an enable switch. You can also choose to start the service on boot. Below that, you can turn off the animation when it slides in so if you turn that off you'll see it just appears instead of actually sliding in I prefer it with the animation on I think it looks a little bit neater when it appears and disappears icon size you've got small normal or large opacity you can actually make this fully transparent here if you want to but be aware on certain backgrounds it makes things pretty much unseeable so I kind of like it around this area just a little bit more and you can see it everything's there and it still looks pretty good show memory usage if you do that you'll now see a bar here showing your RAM you can see how much is used how much is free show app name is on by default if you turn that off it won't show the app name so you'll have to go just by the icons but it does look pretty neat so we'll leave that like that the button section actually allows you to choose which buttons are displayed and right now in omni snitch i suggest you turn off the kill all apps and kill other apps because they just don't work and you're going to hit them by mistake and it's going to cause force closes so if you turn those off you won't accidentally hit them you can see it just shows three buttons now next up we have the drag handle section you can turn it off here but you'll see the handle disappears and you won't be able to access it unless you have another activation method Method, which I don't right now so we're just going to leave that on you can change the positioning again this is completely up to you you can move it up or down you can change the sides you can also change the size of the activation area as well so that just depends on where you're going to put it you can change the color and the opacity again so you don't have to have it glowing blue here you can make it fully transparent of course it will completely disappear you have to remember where you put it but you can see it does work we'll just uh, leave it on 100% for now. Auto hide will hide this little uh, area here but it will mean you have to swipe it twice so if you turn it on you'll see it disappears swipe it once to get that little area back swipe it again and you'll actually get the uh, the overlay so again that's up to you and lastly here we have favorites and this is one of my favorite features so if we go into here you can actually add applications that you always want to access so let's put Android Central in there Badland Game and BT Sport and press OK and now if we go ahead and access this we'll turn that off you can see that we have a little arrow here if you press that little arrow you now have your favorites which you can always access you can have your favorite apps that you always use right there so there you go guys that's the omni snitch application let me know what you guys think peace out